studying the health of our oceans and climate, a private astronaut crew heads home from the space station, and some mission milestones for our Lucy spacecraft, a few of the stories to tell you about this week at NASA. Our Pace Earth Science mission launched aboard a SpaceX Falcon 9 rocket on February 8th from Cape Canaveral Space Force Station. The mission will help us better understand how our oceans and atmosphere exchange carbon dioxide, measure key atmospheric variables related to air quality and Earth's climate, and monitor ocean health, in part by studying phytoplankton, tiny plants and algae that sustain the marine food web. Follow the mission at blogs.nasa.gov slash pace. On February 7th, a SpaceX Dragon spacecraft carrying the four-person crew of Axiom Mission 3 undocked from the International Space Station to begin the crew's return trip to Earth. Axiom Mission 3, the third all-private astronaut mission to the orbiting laboratory, will return with more than 550 pounds of NASA hardware and data from experiments the crew conducted during the mission. Our Lucy spacecraft recently completed the second and largest planned main engine burn of its 12-year mission. These burns, combined with the mission's second Earth gravity assist maneuver targeted for December 2024, will help Lucy transition from its current orbit around the Sun to a new orbit that will carry it beyond the orbit of Jupiter and into the realm of the never-before-explored Jupiter-Trojan asteroids. On February 3rd, our Juno spacecraft made a second close flyby of Jupiter's moon Io. Like Juno's previous flyby of Io in late December 2023, this second pass took Juno about 930 miles above Io's surface. The twin flybys were designed to gain new insight into how the moon's volcanic engine works and investigate whether a global magma ocean exists under the moon's rocky, mountainous surface. That's what's up this week at NASA. For more about what else we're up to, check out nasa.gov.